Hello everyone, it's another video for the channel guys. My name is Shijan Blind and today we're back with another video for the channel guys. And in this video we're going to be checking out the brand new Sonic Speed Simulator update which involves a return skin and a brand new skin as well. Which, I mean, it was kind of, I don't know, it's a bit goofy of an update because I'll show you in a second. But So, so basically today, it's another, like for the past few weeks all they've been doing is returning skins. Like, I think ever since Birthday King Sonic they did. They started to return skins because I mean Sonic Speed Sonic Speed Simulator Reborn technically is like we like basically the entire game is new so basically they're I think what they're trying to do is return every skin in the game for and for making them with like an actual interesting event because most of the skins in the game that came to Sonic Speed Simulator before Sonic Speed Simulator Reborn were like were scavenger hunts so I mean I guess it's it's good that they're bringing them back with like. A bit of a of a like more interesting event, but this event is a hellhole of an event, guys. It absolutely puts a leg inside. It puts a leg on your. It puts a leg in your waist when you trip and fall. From how annoying it is, and it, it's just time consuming. So they returned. So first, let me just tell you what the rewards are. So they returned Chrome Metal Sonic, and then they also added a holographic. Metal Sonic, which is basically Chrome Metal Sonic, but a, a reskin, like a literal reskin of a reskin of a reskin. That's that's how crazy it is. They went from like from a reskin to another reskin of that reskin that is a reskin now. So first we got Metal Sonic, then it evolved to like some type of Chrome Metal Sonic, then it then it went to Chrome to holographic Metal Sonic, which I don't know how that happened, but. I actually got Chrome Metal Sonic when it first came out before Sonic uh, Reborn. So when I claimed like the reward of quote unquote getting getting uh this Sonic, I already had it, so I basically didn't really get anything new, so I just had to complete it. So the thing is they literally pull on your leg because they don't put holographic metal sonic as one of the rewards, like the last reward. Like they make you do every quest and then after you get all those quests then you get this so basically you don't like it, it's re it's re it's weird because the challenges are actually decently hard this time well they're not exactly hard but they're super time consuming like we got uh boost minutes then fall time i have the best strategy for the fall time literally the fall time could take you like two minutes to finish from how easy it is so this is chrome metal, chrome metal sonic it's literally just a metal sonic reskin and then they did bring back a uh, uh, Reaper Metal Sonic, which I'm for sure gonna buy the three pack, and then because if I if I get like 1.7k Robux, I could get the the three pack and get the other skin. So I'm basically gonna buy all the skins every time. So that's gonna be cool, I guess. So then, yeah. All right, I'm trying to not make this video so long. So yeah, let's check out Chrome Metal Sonic because that's the main part of the update. It's a new skin that is a reskin of a reskin of a reskin. That's how many times you have to say reskin. So the cool thing I guess about this is that it has like some type of super sane uh, effects. I like it. It's cute. It, it's pretty mid. I wouldn't. It's just not like a skin that I would always wear. But like once in a while, I guess I would. I would actually wear the skin, but you know, it's it's not like a thing that you could do all the time. So yeah. So we got a reskin of a reskin, and then that's basically the whole update. And even though this update, <clears throat> I enjoyed doing it, but it was it was annoying at the beginning because I was like, dude, this is going to take forever just to complete. But I do have the best way to complete the quest. So to do the boost time, you, do, you just have to do a map. You just need to do a rotation in any world. I did it in Green Hill, which uh, basically the best way if you want to do it in Green Hill, you just go around this place and you're going to literally circle the map from here all the way over there to here and then just spam the boost button while getting rings because the rings give you boost so you could so your boost could load up faster and that's basically for the boost quests and then the easiest part about this is the fall time quest those don't even take three minutes like even though it says 15 minutes or or, or like 12 minutes of fall time all you could do is grab your to tornado well if you don't have tornado then you're basically screwed in this one. If you have tornado, just fly up to the, up to the, like the height, the maximum height, with your tornado like this, and then when you get to that, you're gonna start falling, and then that's what's gonna give you your seconds of fall time. You do this, and it's gonna 
like it's not even gonna take you not even two minutes to complete every fall time quest that's what i did to complete these fast and then for the boost as i said that's pretty much it because those are the only things you have to do they just extend the amount of time that you have to do them the boost time there is no there basically is no cheat code for that besides just collecting rings around the map and that and that's pretty much it because those are the only two quests just extended time and that's pretty much it for the video guys so anyways i hope you enjoyed this video i don't know if i'm gonna upload another video because i am gonna be returning to the facility also guys i'm planning on doing another type of video this I, I can't assure it's this week but hopefully during the weekend of next week because i'm actually gonna be playing through a game that i actually really enjoy playing it's called color or die but yeah guys anyways that's it for the video make sure to subscribe to the channel if you know because that would really help me because we're on the road to 600 subscribers and without further ado guys comment what type of sonic speed simulator videos you also want to see in the channel and no pet simulator x video this week because it did an update this week so yeah anyways see you all